with Julian Hammer. Hernandez, how are you? How's everything? Good, everything is good, man. Just here at the Terrence Crawford versus Amir Khan. Weighing, you know, looking to see a good show and also to see my, uh, you know, people over at top rank, you know, schedule my next fight. I'm here with my like, coach, Butch Sanchez. Hammer time, Coach baby. Sanchez. Hammer time. It was the pleasure to work right now with, you know, with your fighter and, you know, eventually we're going to put, he's going to put a, a work on Saturday night. How, how does this, you well, he's know, you, ready, he's ready for the first round knockout, man. He's ready for the first round hey. knockout. And uh, I just help him train him with his dad. His dad is the head trainer. And uh, we're looking to knock the guy out right away, man. We ain't fucking playing. 16 and 0. And he'll be 17 and 0 uh, tomorrow. 16 and 0. What does it mean that in, in your career? I know what it takes, the effort, the sacrifice. Can you describe to the fight fans, you know, the, all these, you know, sacrifices that you've been paying what is it yeah. for you you know like I, th I think a fighter has many different stages in their lives you know before I was fighting to have nice sneakers and nice clothes now I'm fighting because I have two kids so it's a different I'm a more more of a mature fighter so you know I look at the 16 and 0 and there's a lot of uh, experience in there and that's what's most important it's something that eventually you want to achieve you you're looking for greatness you're looking to pursue you know the world title course, yeah, yeah. and you know get ready to add it you know more more titles yeah. if it comes you know and willing you know to yeah. pursue all of this tell us you know when you fight for a different you know fight it's the same preparation or or, or you look yeah. almost similar in well, the train, other fights we train 100 percent you know and and like you said the title fights are going to be very soon to come you know we're 16 and 0 now so we're going to have our foot in the gas you know, and then that's that's all that's gonna come. In the next year, you know, I'm gonna be making a lot of announcements, so make sure to keep up with me on Instagram and Twitter at Team Hammerhands. And that's it. Yeah, yeah, definitely, you know, people are gonna keep, you know, and stay tuned on your, you know, on your career. Yeah. Uh, for an athlete like you, let me ask you this question. I know, you know, probably some of the viewers, uh, you know, people that will hear this interview, they probably will get offended. But for you, like, to keep an athlete yourself, you know, What's the price that you pay? Because we've seen, you know, like right now, there's some fighters that they use, you know, some kind of asteroids or things that, you know, yeah. that let's not consider them, you know, it's, it's an athlete. So for you being an athlete, what's the price that you pay in order to well, be specific, who you are? In the specific sport that I'm in, you know, you got to be committed 24-7, you know, not just when, you, when you're in the gym, you know, you have to watch your diet, you know, watch all the, the liquid that you intake, you know, it's just, uh, you have to have a good night's sleep. It's just all around to be to be a, a fighter, you know, this caliber, you know. Um, athletes like fighters, they require many sacrifices to be able to give 100%. And to reach out to the top in order to look for world titles, greatness, and yeah. all these things, because, I mean, if he, a boxer cheats in the career, there's, there's supposed to be something in order that yeah, yeah. they could got to take away, you know, a fighter. Because, hey, let's not forget, two athletes are stepping in, in the ring. If someone cheats, hey, let's not forget that you guys put, you know, life in jeopardizing. Oh, yeah, so if the other course. person gets hurt, you know, hey, we don't want to see that. And later on, we got to yeah. fix, you know, certain things or, you know, also, get done something. When, yeah. it could, when we could, you know, do it before... These things happen, so that's one one of the reasons that I ask you. You know, I know people they're gonna be like, oh, you know, why you ask that certain question? But I think it's important for the viewers to see, you know, and hear yourself that right. you you keep yourself an athlete. You you know you pay the price, and I bet you because I do, I bet you that you also sacrifice maybe birthdays or you know oh, holidays, of holidays, course. Yeah, of course, of course. Um, but the thing about the, the steroids and all that stuff, yeah, I, I mean, um, unfortunately, we're in a time where it's, it's used a lot more often. And because of that, the sport had to rewire the way they did things. And in, in, the, in that process, I believe it turns a lot of fans off. So, And just hearing the, that negativity in the news related to the sport just doesn't bring the sport any positivity. So that's not even something that, uh, you know, we even should even shine light on. Let those people handle that, and, and that's it. I know I'm a clean fighter, so... That's all I like. That's care. what it's supposed yeah. to be for an athlete. Very quick. Danny Jacobs, Canelo. What do you think? Is it 50-50 fight? I think it's a very entertaining fight. Um, I've been around both fighters, so 
I'm just looking to have a, a great time watching that fight and just a, you know a, a fight that reminds people of the, the the joy and positive boxing can bring to the to everybody. Julian Hammer, I know you have certain things to do today. We're definitely gonna stay tuned on the you know April 20. Invite your fight fans and everybody to see you know this fight. Thank you, man. Yeah, man. I've, Okay, we're having a good time here in New York City. Madison Square Garden is going to be a great time. Terrence Crawford, Amir Khan. You know, I'll be, uh, make sure to check on Team Hammerhands, you know, Instagram, Twitter to uh, follow my next fights and all that stuff. There you go, guys. Thanks again and wishing you the best and God bless you. Thank you.